gives Haley to be married to Scott. I do. Very good. Scott, go ahead and take your bride. And you may all be seated. We are gathered here today to join the two of you in the bonds of holy matrimony. The uniting of two individuals from two separate families and backgrounds to come together and establish a new family is an important and memorable event. Your uniting here today is an occasion of great significance, which we can all celebrate. Marriage is not a casual event, nor is it simply a private affair between two people. Marriage is to be entered into responsibly. This marriage brings together this day two individuals, two families, and two communities of faith. Marriage is an honorable estate, not to be entered into lightly but thoughtfully and reverently. Marriage is a commitment to take another person as a friend, companion, and lover. So Scott, I'm going to ask you, do you take Haley to be your lawfully wedded wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep you only unto her for as long as you both shall live? I do. Very good. And Haley, do you take Scott to be your lawfully wedded husband? Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep you only unto him for as long as you both shall live? I do. Very good. At this time, I'm going to ask the two of you to turn and face one another and join hands as you enter the bonds of matrimony. <laughs> and so, the wedding rings you're about to exchange seals the vows of marriage and represents a promise for eternal and everlasting love. So Scott, will you take the ring and place it on Haley's finger? <laughs> and will you look into her eyes and repeat after me? I, Scott, take thee, Haley. I, Scott, take thee, Haley. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better or for worse. For better or worse. For richer or for poorer. For richer or for poorer. In sickness and in health. <laughs> in sickness and in health. <laughs> to love and to cherish forever. To love and to cherish forever. And there I give you my pledge. And there I give you my pledge. Very good. And now, Haley, will you take the ring and place it on Scott's finger? <laughs> and will you look into his eyes and repeat after me? I, Haley, take thee, Scott. I, <laughs> I Haley, take thee, Scott. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold <laughs> from this day forward. For better, for worse. For better, for worse. For richer, for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. Sickness and in health. To love and to cherish forever. To love and to cherish forever. And there I give you my pledge. And there I give you my pledge. Very good. We have come together today and heard the willingness of the two of you to be joined in marriage. You have come of your own free will and in our presence have declared your love and commitment to each other. You have given and received a ring as a symbol of your promises. Therefore, by the power vested in me by the state of Nevada, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride.